everyone. He's Eddie Olchek, Ray Ferraro, you will see in here in just a moment, and I'm Mike Emmerich. Tonight we focus on a team that is at the end of a long road trip, and it hasn't been good so far. But what do you tell them before the last, thank goodness, the last game? Well, if you can win this game, you don't have to worry about the prior games that you had on this long road trip. Let's make it a positive trip by ending it the right way and finding a way to win this game. Manchester's ownership and management team cannot be happy with the results of this trip to this point. There might be some big changes if they don't win this game here tonight. So the pressure is on to win this last game before they head back home off the road trip. Let's look at the starting netminders. This man's getting the start in net tonight. He looked more than ready in the warm-up, and that might translate to a great night in net for the home team. This man's the starter again tonight. He plays really large in the net, doesn't give the opponent much to shoot at, hoping to come up big for the visitors. It's a wonderful night for hockey. Adirondacks got the puck, and they get to make the first play. Onside. Takes it to the corner. He's got that point pass. Shoots one. Up to the point. Pucks loose off the enemy this time. Good shooting place. Goes back deep for it. Manchester's got it back in their own zone. And he is reefed. He's certainly on a mission out there. He's trying to set a tone for his team in what should be a really physical contest. Chooses the corner. Gets that one on a cross. And it's in and out of the glove. A neutral zone carry. Feeds the point. Missed the net. Good thing that didn't hit the net. That thing was moving quick. Let's hope that there's lots more going to happen here other than what we've seen in the first part of this game. The teams are gently prodding and trying to find an opening, but there's not much going on. Walking a thin line near the border there. Denied by the defense. Puck loose. Penalty call coming. Watch for his signal here. Manchester's got two on this one for tripping. Now, this is a tough call. He was trying to play the puck, but he tripped up the attacking player. There's always a start to your power play night, and this is number one. Penalty for number 26. Got possession. Try to clear the puck. Oh, good job to block that and keep play moving. Routine play done well. Gets in and he'll look over his options. That's a good pat save. Nicely received at the point. Side to side they go trying to generate something. Shoots. Outstanding point blank save. Uh, with this puck being so close to that, this is all a reactionary save. Sends it back the other way. Fires in front. Big shot from the point. They need some net front presence. Point to point. Passed across point to point. And he gets it back. Point to point. Hammered. Tries to clear. Smart recovery by Kopitar. And that one cleared by the penalty killers. Adirondacks carrying it through center. Back on his stick. Can he make him chase it? Clear. A lot of work, but penalty time less and less now. Flings it. Shot. Terrific point blank save. Good job of clearing. Puck is grabbed by Brodeur. Adirondacks leaving its own end. He moves that one ahead through center. Adirondacks power play did not do it for them. Wonderful save. What skill by both goalie and shooter. You don't get many better opportunities than that. Great save. 
That's really demoralizing after a while when you do just everything right and can't find a way to score. But they got to do their best not to be discouraged. I, I like the lot about that power. Manchester's goaltending has been solid all year. When you look back at that last huge save, you know why. A little over nine minutes to be played here in the first. Game still waiting for its first goal. Good face-off win. Wants the shelter of the corner here. Took it up the boards and holds. Has that point pass as well. Manchester's in their own end and carrying it on. Into the end of attack. Shoot! A lightning light glove save! Big face-off win. Shot on. Slides it to the point. With a shot. Oh, that was close. There's not really much place to go. Oh, what a mean, mean hit. Enough said. Here they go. Oh, that was not a good hit at all. Now somebody's coming to the aid of the fallen teammate. Sing and the dancers dance. This guy crossed over from one side to the other in that fight. Well, if fighting is dancing, he is not a very good singer. Thunder's got a little bit of swagger going now. Their man's won the fight. The crowd is ecstatic. on that face-off, tying the man up. Gets in. What'll he do? Flings it. Waffle boarding. A shot. Terrific save there. Didn't look like he had anything to shoot at, and he made it tough. A quick developing play right in front. Almost looks like he's too close to the goaltender. Waits with it. Thinking attack here. Dominance right now. Swept away. A whistle and a rest. The Monarchs with a face off win. Manchester's continuing to probe up the wing. Shoots one. Turned away off the path. Wonderful work and goal. Picked up. Just a good rub out there. Got that pass near the blue line and now looks ahead. Can't get a shot on it. 54 showing. Tries to clear. Free puck now. Puck loose. Good defensive positioning there. That's the end of the first period. A period that only a goalie can like. Nothing, nothing. Fans, your donations have made it possible for kids in need to see their heroes live from our tickets for kids. Manchester's hanging into this game largely on the strength of the man between the pipes. Here is just one of his many saves in that period. We'll be right back. One period played. A second period is about to begin. What do you think of what we've seen so far? Doc, I know we have no score here, but I thought the period was pretty easy for both goaltenders. So what do the players have to do? 
shoot for the middle of the net, maybe look for a second or third chance opportunity. Then they might get a puck up on the board. Passed in the corner, Labor. That one is pointed to him. A shot, big save. Hangs on to that one, and he'll see a face-off right here. I don't know if he's going to make a save much easier than that one. He's in good position. It's a rather routine stop. Face-off win here. Oh, broke it up. Let's the shot fly. Got his stick on it. He covers and holds on. Defensive zone win. Shot, score! Only one perfect goalie remains now. You get this close to the goaltender, the puck on your stick, you gotta snap it quick. Whoa, it looks like his trapper's got a hole in it there, and so he gets beat low to the glove side. Thunders had him pinned up in their own end of the ice a lot. A lot of chances and finally a goal. Tied up, but a good reach and a good step in there for possession. Back on his stick. Can he generate something from there? Takes that pass from the other point man. Missed the net! He hammered that puck and just went over the net. On to Brodeur. Adirondacks moving the puck up the wing. Let's it go. Didn't get through. The Monarchs start the rush up ice. Moving it now in center ice. Puts one on. Outstanding save made off a terrific chance. Scooped up. Moving well with it in the defensive zone. And he steps in. Let's it go. Paddle the side. Score! Goalie made the initial stop with those quick hands. Beat him on the rebound. Oh, he's done everything he can here. This is a desperation move. The puck is almost into an open net. Yet look how close he makes it. Adirondacks ahead by two and thoroughly out shooting the opposition. Over seven minutes have passed. Just recently another goal and so the lead is two. Good use of the stick, broke that pass up. Let's it go, hung right over him and couldn't get it passed. Seems like he was in too tight on the goaltender. From the winger. Gains the zone and looks over his options. Slid back across from one point to the other. Perfect tip by the stick. Let's it go. Deflected off the blocker. One timer. Ooh, what a break. Shot hit the man. And play is stopped for a penalty. Adirondacks roster goes down by one here. At least briefly, a minor penalty for hooking. The referees are looking for this. Anytime you stop skating and reach with your stick and pull on the opponent, you're going to the penalty box. Manchester's opportunity on the power play is their first of this game. Let's see how they do. 
number 74. To the draw the tie up, and his team prevails. They must retreat and start back again. Manchester's on the move through the neutral zone. Out in front. That shot came from just six inches. You talk about cutting down the angle. Perfectly executed by the goaltender. Manchester's got another win. Didn't miss by much. That's going to happen. There's not a lot of room there. He just missed the shot. Good work there. They'll have to try it again because of the defender's stick. One-timer. Score! And it's a one-goal game. One thing that was very noticeable on that power play goal is that nobody held on to the puck for very long. It was move the puck, move yourself, find the best lane, get it to the net. And so just because you're in the butterfly doesn't mean you can give in to the shooter. You still have to move. He looked like he thought he was in perfect shape to make the stop and didn't have to move. Bad guess. And they've won the neutral zone faceoff. Great stick work prevents the pass from being complete. To the point it comes. He can start some danger here. And drives on through center. What a ripper! Great stick save. Right in that catching glove. Good work. Manchester's recoiling back in their own end. Perfect passing right through center. He's got a piece of it with the glove. Freezes play. Manchester's fans sitting behind their net got up and showed their respect by bowing to him after that huge save. Just under six minutes to be played. The lead has just been cut in half. Let's see if there's a shift in momentum. Gives it on a cross from the point. Wow, what a glove save! What a glove save. He showed him the glove and he took it away. up there and a good reach and possession nicely into the zone he takes that point pass score what a quick answer that was from out top the goaltender had no chance on that slap shot it looks to me sometimes as the goaltender's guessing a bit, and when he guesses, he drops into the default butterfly position to see if he can cover enough net. Adirondacks got a two-goal lead. Good time to have it. Late in the second period. What will they do next? What will be their mode of attack? Scored by number two. Assisted by number 44. Taken over again. Adirondack setting things up through the neutral zone. Gives it to the point. Bumped off. Picks it up back there. Blocked away. It's an onside play. Hard work here. Kicked out of the scrum. Puck grab. They're ready to go. Good pass off the boards. The cursed goals are the ones in the first minute and the last. Will we see one here? That puck's loose. He couldn't get through the roadblock. Thunder setting it up as they move through center. Takes that pass. Loose puck. Solid defensive play there. Blocked. The second period has been played, and that's the fun part. We now look forward to the third if you are the holder of the winning ticket, please take it to our customer service kiosk. 
in section 144 on the concourse before the end of tonight's game to claim your prize. And thank you for supporting minor... Adirondack strength has been in goal scoring, and this one gave them a two-goal lead. That's the one they enjoy right now. We'll have more in a moment. Forty minutes down, at least twenty minutes to go. What are your thoughts so far? Manchester's coaching staff, Doc, has to be pretty pleased the way they played through the first forty minutes of play. One area of concern has been their offense. They need to take advantage of all the time of possession and finally put the puck into the back of the net. In the slot, he scores! Two straight goals! So sometimes you just get so lucky. He's not shooting the puck there. The goaltender's fooled as the puck doesn't come with any velocity at all. Adirondack's goal has built an even bigger lead. We're in the third period. For the opposition, at least that is fortunate. Good reach there. Adirondack's up the wing controlling play now. Got it right back. Wanting to generate something up the wing. Back to the point. Lugged along the line. Receives that pass from the other side. Save! Great pressure. Out to the point with it now. Looking for options. Puts one on. Rondax lugging it up the wing. And they've got it again. Points it. Takes that pass from the other point. He banks the pass ahead. Big shot to the point. Off the mark. Every once in a while, you unload a clunker. That was one of them. Manchester's in control of the puck up the wing. Using the point. Cursed by a broken stick. Knifing his way near the boards. A good stick there, so no complete pass. Takes that pass that was just slipped ahead to him. Adirondacks in control through the neutral zone. Puck skipped away, he was knocked down. Up the wing and moving well. Back in his defensive end to get it. Thunders in possession now as they move up the wing. Good try there. Carried right through the 50-yard line. Using the point. He's got it. A wonderful scoring chance denied. Adirondacks finding its way to center ice. He's in on an onside play. Right to the point. Back and forth they go between the points. Skates it down the wall. Hope check. Can he clear? Manchester's controlling play now up the wing. Gives it over to the point. Gets that one on a cross. From the right side to the middle, right on his tape. Gets across, looks over his options. Back in front! He's got that pass at the point. Side to side they go, trying to generate something. Held there for a face-off coming up next. There's not many saves easier than this for the goaltender. He gets his blocker on it. He's in good position, and he deflects this away. Just a hair under four minutes still to play in this period. Do you see a pattern developing here? They're up now by three. Good job on the draw. 
Got it in the slot. Around to the corner. Shoots. Score! Another step in the road back. They're down by two. How about that pass? He did not have a lot of time. He got it to the goal scorer and he put it in. A lot of times the goaltender feels like his positioning is perfect and he's got the net covered. Guess what? He doesn't. Manchester's goal gets them to within two. There is still time, thus there is still hope. It's a good thing. Neutral zone face off one. Possession established here. Stood up there. Gotten quickly back. Shoots. Oh, terrific save on a great chance. You want to score goals, you have to go to this area. You got to find a way to put it in the net. And here again is Ray. Manchester's got to get back on the practice ice because they've had so many chances to score. They haven't had any finish, and they can't hit the net. They are my Ray. It's, it's sort of hard to watch those, isn't it? So many close calls, and this game would be different. A big win. Let's see what happens. Got it at the point. Loose puck did not go very well there. Manchester's in possession as they move up the wing. Snaps one in there. Wonderful save. Goalie to the bench. Substitution made. Net open. Not there. Takes a perfect pass. Well, that's what your wings are for. They give it to you right in the center. Sends to the point. What a strong wrist shot. Sticked away. Gains the zone. Net open. No. Gotta get it on net. No luck. Net empty. And cash is in. goal puts this one away everybody should head for the exits that's a good feeling on the bench you've locked it up now with the empty netter possession established good reach there Adirondacks carrying on up the wing Manchester's getting to the neutral zone. Point to point to point. Perfect connection right through center. Centering pass. Let's it go. A wonderful shot answered quickly. Terrific stop from right in front of the net, but you got to find a way to put the puck in the net. So the teams have left the ice and are getting rested for next time. For this time, for Eddie and Ray, Mike Emmerich saying good night.